is my hundred day journey on the, my journey of nourishment. To say I'm grateful only touches part of it. I'm honored and sad and joyful. I did things in these hundred days that I never thought I could. Today is my 20 month anniversary with my food, body, and healing transformation. And this anniversary I'm really celebrating. I just realized that I went camera shy after sharing my vulnerability with food the other day. I'm getting back in front of the camera. Only time and trust in yourself will bring it to light, but your work and this journey has value. It's bringing out a more powerful version of you. I place a lot of my self-worth on the amount of weight that I lost. Of my journey of nourishment isn't all about losing weight. Just asking to be healed. For friendships, they all come in different types and sizes and flavors, and I love that. I'm so thankful for the friends that I have. Introducing real, beautiful, nourishing foods into my life. I used to do two supplemental shakes a day in one meal, and that worked for a while. This works even better. I have so much more energy, and I just feel so much better. I wanted to honor my spiritual gifts, and one of those is honoring my intuition and what steps forward. That the universe has led me here for me to grow. So I decided I'm going to start loving this. I love my body. I love the work that it's done. I love the healing that it's asked me to do. And I love that it has been by my side every step of the way. Today I embrace. I am my I also trusted a new person to to help me with my journey. Maggie Christopher, my holistic nutrition counselor. I held on to her business card for three years. While Maggie and I talk about food and she's given me lots of information around, around it, talking about what's going on at the deeper levels, that's what I needed. And she's helped me heal some really old patterns I'm so grateful for her and so grateful that I leaned in and trusted her. Technically end my 100 day journey of nourishment. A little stronger, a little more confident, more loving and compassionate with myself.